been following this. Uh, the plane yeah. was at about uh, 38,000 feet when this yeah. happened. And it's weird that I, I, there's a whole lot of questions I have. The cloud just suddenly appearing is one. But the other, here's one of the things I learned about turbulence when we were all talking about this. Like in the average turbulence, the plane may not only be going up and down five to 10 feet in severe turbulence, the plane may have changed altitude less than 50 feet. But still, it did that kind of yeah, yeah. damage in the cockpit. It's really amazing what uh, the atmosphere can do in an airplane at high speed. So it'll be interesting to see what they finally say about that uh, turbulence. We were thinking it might be clear air turbulence at first, but nope, they were in the top of a thunderstorm. All right, tomorrow morning, no thunderstorms. We'll be in the 50s around Metro Phoenix, mid 60s tomorrow afternoon. So much cooler than today. It'll be a lot cloudier as well as uh, we sort of get the leading edge of the storm clouds moving our way. Boy, it was really nice around the entire state. 72 at Yuma, 68 at Safford, 57 at Sholo and 57 degrees at Prescott. Well, let's take a look at a couple of the snowfall amounts. They're getting a little bit crazy, uh, but we could see this much snow. <laughs> Over 20 inches of snow in the Happy Jack area by Monday morning, 20 for Flagstaff, 8 inches at Pine Top Lakeside. Uh, these numbers seem phenomenally high, uh, more like maybe 10 to 15, but this is one of our kind of trusted weather models that we use in terms of snowfall. Well, let's look at measurable rainfall chances around Metro Phoenix, and yeah, we still think that on Sunday and Monday and Tuesday when we first alerted those three days will individually have some rain at some point during the day and in terms of Sunday itself look at the chances they're really high during the early morning hours but right around sunrise those chances for rain start plummeting so it does look like what rain we get on Sunday is mainly going to be during the early morning hours but that doesn't preclude afternoon showers at all 76 for a high today 67 is average we were only three degrees off a record high of 79 degrees and right now we're at 61 the air is calm and the dew point is at 34. Tonight with the high clouds, we'll see a low around 50 degrees. Then for tomorrow, partly sunny with a high of about 68. First alert seven day forecast for you with those three first alert days, Sunday, Monday and Tuesday. Lots of rain in the valley, lots of snow in the high country and temperatures cooling down. Highs only in the 50s. Not bad tomorrow, then we're ready for it, Royal. Thanks. Well, if you have